everybody welcome back to your origami episode today we're going to make something that maybe is a little bit hard putting them together it's a crown it's a crown slash attire see this is a tire that can actually roll and roll and then when we do this it's a crown you can put it on your head and do anything with it and then you can turn it into a full and then you can turn it in a full circle and then just keep on keeps on going so let's get started with this project i would say tire slash crown we need eight pieces of paper and here we go a pieces of paper and no matter what size it is mine is always 15 by 15. now the project is we need a pyramid base and how do you do that is you need to do an angle fold and then just like that an angle fold is done then open it up do it to the other side as well there we go and then now open it up turn it around do a side fold and just like that then open it up do it to this side as well do this side fold for this side as well and there we go just like that boom now we just go on this do something like this so there's a pyramid base this is what we call a pyramid base and then if you open it back up and you do it this way it's actually a square base that we're not going to use today but we're going to use the pyramid base today and first you need to put it on a triangle nothing else special now you do something like this like half this part see that middle line this line you touch that middle line just like that boom now do the same to this side as well done now do it to the other side while facing it do it to the and then do it to here boom you'll end up with something like this like a kite shape and then now now you see this line is like that now you just need to do see this triangle and to fold it up not too much or it'll be like that but exactly on on this line just like that do it to all four of the triangle side opening up whatever you want to call it this thing boom done and now you need eight of these there we have we've got eight different color ones so i can show you guys how to put them better now you only need two at the beginning and with these eight different these three different colors we're going to make a cool pattern now you just need to do something like this make these triangles go back like that and do the same to this one put it flat and like kind of open the one that you are going to put it into that like make the triangles kind of not go bendy but straight and then for this side, you just need to do this, open up a little bit, and then put your fingers through it. Not too much. And there we go. We have a gap right there. And then do the same to this side. And there we go. We've got two gaps like that. Now we, we have to put them like this. Now we need to put these two into these two. Put them correctly. If my calculations are correct. This will fit perfectly. Now let's just fold it up and done. Okay guys, I did some off camera putting them together and now you see there's a lovely pattern. These two pinks are like the walls of two worlds. This world, orange is taking over yellow and this world is supposed to be yellow taking over orange but i need to put this yellow on and if you didn't see how clear didn't see clearly how to put them together i'll show you show you how to put them together and if you have a lot of them already put them together you would like to do something like this and then put it on the table and then do what i did like popping it up mm -hmm. And you and guys, you can always go back to the video one and watch how I did it again. But I'm just showing it again. Okay, 
Now do it to the other side as well. And then now you need to do something like this and then this and then boom. Now the last piece is kind of a little bit difficult because you definitely need to put that one into that one. So I'll show you how to do it. You first need to straighten these two, of course, always. Now you need to do something like this, put it in like this and then just like that. And then we've got these two popped up. Now we just need to straighten these two then put one in at a time, and then the other one in, and then... Oh yeah, by the way, I like to put two in at a time, because I used to do these, and then when I put one in at a time, the other one will just go wrong, and then the one that I just put in at once, it will just go wrong as well. Now, you can see, you've got this lovely crown, and also, there's actually another use. You can use it as a pot puppy like you can put it like that like this like a puppy bag hello i am an origami master just like that and then now you can turn it into your car wheel and then later videos when we get better at origami i might teach you guys how to make a car with with this design and some other design like the putting them together but that's in a later video and i hope you guys enjoy the video and if you have hit that subscribe button and that like button i'll see you in the next round